a lot of people ask me when they see me, why do I keep my nails so long? And as a guy, people are kind of grossed out. They want me to cut it, but I can't because I use them for guitar playing. First thing, let me address you ladies. There's a secret item that I use that my mentor and my teacher told me about that he used to use. And it's a company called Hard As Hoof. Use only a little bit, about this much, and you just, like if it was lotion, put it on your nails and you just rub it in and that right there will strengthen your nail. It's almost like vitamins to your body. I used to use nail polish actually to make them stronger. The uh, hardening polishing, I don't know what you call them, but I used to use that. Yeah, it used to work. It used to make my nails stronger, but the problem was that when I was getting rid of that polishing, I used to use acetone. That's very acidic and it's actually not good for your nails. Over time, it actually weakened my nail. And the only time it would be strong was when I had the nail hardening polishing on it. I don't know why I said that in a staccato way. Yeah, my nails were just becoming very weak and very brittle because of the acetone. And if you want your nails to not break, you want to stay away from acetone. You want to use other healthier remedies to get rid of any nail polishing that you may have. Because in reality, you're just making your nails weaker when you use acetone. And that's probably one of the biggest, if not the biggest thing that you can stop doing to make your nails stronger or weaker however that goes but i've had this for i would say five six years and if it wasn't because i gave away half this thing would probably be still full my teacher told me about this about five years ago and he still had some from like the 90s which means that you don't really use a lot and i don't use it every day i to be honest i forget about it sometimes but it does make my nails stronger and I don't have to use it all the time. And when I do, it's that little bit of amount that I showed you. It leaves your nail looking pretty shiny and pretty good. Now, what else can you do to make your nails stronger? Drink a lot of water. If you were to consume something that would help your nails grow more and be healthier, it's a ton, a ton of water. We underestimate the value that water brings to our life. It's, we all know that it's essential to live and has a lot of benefits, but it's just little things like that, that water really helps with our body. Outside of just being able to live, it helps with our fingers. If you have weak nails and you have a lot of like uh, skin pulling up, there might be a cause a deficient in maybe some minerals, but most of the time for the average person, it's just water. Setting you ladies aside and any guys who might like to have their nails long. Let me talk to musicians. If you like to play guitar with your nails, there are a lot of different reasons why you wanna go that way. I'm not trying to convince you either or in this video, but if you do go this route, there are certain things that you wanna do with your nails to maximize on your guitar playing. If you can see, my nails are all shaped this way. And this is a reason why. On this side, I shave my nails. And on this side, I leave it a little bit longer. This is the reason why. When you grab the string, the first thing that hits it is this side of your nails. Because your hand is like this, correct? So this side is what hits it first the last thing that hits the string is this side and that's just because the way your hand naturally falls on the guitar you want it to slide that's why it's cut on this side and then hook at the end if you have the nail on this side the first thing that you're going to experience is hooking you don't want it to hook at first you want it to slide and that's because you have more control of your sound. Because it slides, I can already tell where the string is and when I want to hit it. There's only what, a few millimeters away from no nail to a lot of nails. But after you've played X amount of hours, you can already determine what you want to do between the distance of the string from here to here. Even though it's small, you can pick up on that. 